right, what's going on, people? There is not really need for an intro, so I'm just going to say, uh, yeah, go to the first link, w.gg, save yourself 10% off using the support of creator code, Mellow D D support of creator, is this Fortnite? Probably not, I'm, I'm sorry, uh, let, let's, let's, let's get into it, merch in the description as well, let's get it, let's talk about the modern day Gen Z TikTok OnlyFans slay sis girl now don't be persuaded brothers this is not the ordinary female what you see standing here before you is what i call the apex predator the 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 only thing standing between me and slapping this picture of this girl is the fact that I don't want to have to buy a new computer because I'm a broke boy. Now, majority of these girls in Gen Z just don't get it, okay? They talk about having equal rights as a man, having the same rights as a man, being able to do every single thing that a man can do, and quite literally, I think that whenever a woman says this, they are deemed an idiot in my book. But women, you gotta give us men a break nowadays, okay? You can't just expect a man now to be able to just walk up to a girl and just ask them out because now it's not seen as normal. It's seen as creepy or weird. Whenever a guy gets rejected by a girl, they don't really think anything negatively of them. They just keep a truck in majority of the time. Now, whenever a girl gets rejected by a guy, they start saying, oh, well, he's not that good looking anyway. Oh, well, uh, he's a bit short anyway. Oh, well... He's most likely gay. Most likely that is not the chance at all. He's not gay. That's not what it is at all. Sometimes men just have their own things that they want. Just like you have your own preferences, men have their own preferences too. And you just have to grow up to understand that. Now this whole thing where women are basically just trying to, oh yeah, uh, I don't want a man unless he's six foot, makes a hundred thousand dollars yearly you don't even make that yearly matter of fact you expect a guy to take care of you when you won't even take care of the guy you're supposed to take care of each other if you get married what is love nowadays anyway like for some reason here's a quick example people are starting to say that oh yeah maybe andrew tate is actually right maybe andrew tate is actually on to something andrew tate has always been on to something that's what you people fail to understand he's not a misogynist and he doesn't see women as something negative all the people that actually dislike andrew tate don't even really have a reason to dislike andrew tate now i'm not saying all the things that he says or does is 100 correct but i do believe in the the empowerment that he's trying to give to men bring the strong men back bring the independent men back the, the men that did not depend on women and if you think that a strong man telling more strong men to get strong a strong man telling weak men that they should be strong but they should also be emotional that type of man is a good leader those are the those are the type of men that i would honestly let babysit my kids honestly we got women out here that be trying to get all caked up and whatnot got all these fake big booties out here like bruh i don't even want to touch that it looks like a waterbed it looks so fake like bro if you get that fake booty and you sit it on my lap i'm gonna hit you with this kamehameha plus rasengan l plus ratio zuardo move real quick you better get up off me with that oh,